you all won back the license for, for Disney princesses, that you'll be doing that, that toy line again. You won it back from Hasbro after they took it from you back in 2016. And this is a partnership that was a very long-running partnership with Mattel. Things fell apart before you were the CEO there. How did you change this? How did you fix this and win this business back? Did you go directly to Bob Chapek? Well, this was a great win for Mattel. Disney Princess and Frozen together are, you know, one of the crown jewels of the Walt Disney Company with a huge wealth of characters and stories to build on. And we couldn't be more excited. The relationship with Disney is very strong. We've been doing a lot of things together recently. We just won the uh, Lightyear license. And we expect to grow the, uh, the business from the current level. Given our leadership position in the Dallas category, our strength and capabilities, and proven expertise to grow, to, to manage, grow, and develop evergreen franchises. We expect great things from this partnership. And as I said, uh, grow it meaningfully from the current level. But really, how, how did the talk start? Because, I mean, this was a huge win for you all. It was a huge loss for Hasbro. And um, it, it, was, it, it happened after things kind of went wrong in 2016 or leading up to 2016. I know Disney was unhappy with how the brand was being managed. What, what happened? How did you change that? Well, it's about trust, it's about relationship, and we've proven over the last few years that we know how to manage franchises, how to develop brands, and if, if you look at our own track record over the last few years, hitting uh, uh, such high level of growth this you know, in the past year, projecting additional growth, having broad-based success across multiple categories, with toys that resonate at levels we have not seen in years, we are able to, to infuse our brands with cultural relevance, create demand, and then work hard to fulfill it with very strong supply chain and broad-based capabilities. I know this time it's going to be managed by your team that also manages Barbie, and, and that was pretty significant, too. But was this a discussion that you had directly with Bob Chapek, or did it take place underneath you? Well, I can tell you I was very involved. This is an important priority for the company. And, yes... Princess, Disney Princess, and Frozen will be managed by the same team that managed Barbie. Barbie just reached a record high this year that uh, in terms of sales, in terms of growth. Barbie was the number one property globally, globally across the entire industry for the second year in a row. It hit 24% growth for the, for the year. So it's, you can see that with our capabilities, with our expertise, a lot of expectation, and uh, we're very confident we can deliver on those expectations.